goodbye, Ice Cream in the dock. Wave goodbye to Naughty One, too. You know the Naughty One, because they'll be waving back. Oh, they're both naughty. Wow. Yes. That's how you know. When you say that, they reveal themselves. Welcome to the world famous Jingle Cruise, where we are world famous for being famous all over the world. My name is Skipper Dwayne. I'll be your skipper today. And we begin our journey on the Amazon River in South America, the largest river in the world by far. Four times larger than the next largest river, the mouth of the Amazon is 90 miles across. Have you ever crossed a bridge 90 miles? You never will unless you go to the Amazon. Look at there, guys. Hot dogs. There's two more right there. Because this is close. They make a sound like a sheep. Bah, bah. Yes, friends, they are bah hot dogs. And you are on the Jingle Cruise. Here on the left is Inspiration Falls. Legend has it that Inspiration Falls received its name because as people would watch the falls and listen to the water tinkling down, they would become inspired to go. To go deeper into the jungle, so that's what we're going to do. As we leave the Amazon of South America behind us, we find ourselves in Central Africa on the Congo. So let's see how far we can go. Have you guys all seen the Jungle Book? Pretty much everybody, yeah. Great. If you haven't seen it yet, there it is. Or if you want to see it again, it's worth the second view. Uh oh. Our welcoming party left the canoe. Something scared them. I can't see what scared them. Canoe? Oh, there's what scared them over there, guys. It's a giant python. These giant pythons get to be 30 feet long. They're kind of scary, but they're also kind of friendly. They will develop a crush on you. But it's a very constricted relationship. I don't recommend it. So we're going to stop by my camp, pick up a couple things. Oh, no, we're not. The gorillas invaded the camp. Oh, look what they did to my stuff. They got the guns. That's not good. Uh-oh, look what they did to my Jeep. I could get that thing to start, but they got it to turn over. And now, friends, we find ourselves on the Nile River, the longest river in the world, also in Africa. 4,132 miles long. It goes on for Niles and Niles and Niles. If you don't believe me, you're clearly in disbelief, right? You guys are good. <laughs> Home to the world's largest and most dangerous land animal in the world, the African bull elephant. Louder. He's the second most dangerous. The most dangerous is over here. That's his mother-in-law. Oh. <laughs> this sandstone formation is often taken for granted, but I think it rocks. It's one of our bolder features here in the Jungle Cruise. And this friend is known as the African belt. We have giraffe, we have wildebeest, gazelle, and fowler zebra. This is where they all come down to drink water every day out of the Nile. We even have a pride of lion up here enjoying their favorite meal, zebra on the rocks. Blood rare. <laughs> oh, look at here, friends. There's a party that took off a couple days ago. They've been treated by a rhino. Oh, that's sure not good. Oh boy, that's my good friend Ahanas on the bottom. Looks like that rhino is trying to poke Ahanas. <laughs> that's why you never want to be the lone man on the totem pole. Ahanas will get the point. In the end. <laughs> All right, friends, coming into view now, the world famous, world renowned natural wonder, Schweitzer Falls. Schweitzer Falls was named after that great African explorer, Dr. Albert Falls. He showed up his expedition to Hunter Vasco back in 1876. Schweitzer Falls are very beautiful. People come from all over the world to see them. But they're also extremely dangerous. We'll go over that later. <laughs> so the Jungle Lake Navigation Company has one amazing free Christmas coupons and specials going on this year. We were able to get half off on a plane. Next area is kind of dicey, folks. It can be a little dangerous. These hippos look very calm, even cute on the surface, but they are very big and very strong animals. They are extremely territorial, and if they think we get too close, they will charge the boat, and they're strong enough to capsize our boat. They capsized four boats just yesterday on the Jingle Cruise. Only three of them are mine, so we might be okay. Well, look out, look out. Oh, I think we made it, guys. Good job. Wow. Now, as we head into Headhunter territory, it's kind of a scary place to be headed. But we're going to go in anyway. First thing we notice, the tribal dancers up there dancing in a circle. That can only mean one thing, friends. The 
Guardians. The Dallas Guardians. The drummers are beating them out of message. I'll try to interpret the same ambush, spears, and duck. Oh, they got guys ambush on the left. Ambush, the down. <laughs> They just messed me go spear today. I think they were just practicing their shake spear. And here we are, everyone's favorite. The eighth wonder of the world. The backside of water. And if you look at the back of the boat, you can even see the side of water. It's kind of a bonus feature for you guys. And now we find ourselves on the Mekong River in Cambodia, home to large river crocodiles and ancient temple ruins. This ancient temple we're about to pass through is over 700 years old. Very ancient, very sacred, and very, very scary stuff inside. You guys all ready to go in? Yeah. All right, keep your eyes open. I'm going to close mine. <laughs> Over here, guys, we have a baby elephant playing under a full moon. You don't see that every day. I see it every trip, but you don't see that every day. And yes, these elephants will try to get us wet. I will try to keep us dry. Uh oh, uh oh, sorry, guys. Sorry, sorry. Just kidding. You guys weren't exactly fearless on that one. I'll let you know that. I thought you guys were fearless, but not quite so much. All right. Now, as we come to the most dangerous part of our journey, the return to civilization. I would like to point out and left up here, Trader Santa, but we'll do that in a minute because we are backed up with a traffic jam here. All right. So where are you guys from here? California. California? Where are you guys from? Denver. Denver, Colorado. Where are you guys from? Georgia. Florida? Me too. Georgia. Where are you guys from there? Missouri. Missouri? Where are you guys from on the far back? I'm sorry? I no, I heard you. I'm just sorry. <laughs> oh, just kidding. Just kidding. The back of the boat always gets it because there's nobody else to go to. <laughs> Idaho's awesome. Uh, anybody's first time on the Jingle Cruise? Oh, this one. Good, me too. Good. Sir, can you pull your mask up a little bit, please? Thank you. Anybody's last time on the Jingle Cruise? <laughs> good. So far, so good. All right. Uh, anybody got any good jokes? Mine are pretty lame, right? You've heard most of them. I do have a good uh, pandemic joke. You ready? What does Santa use to clean his sleigh? What? Sanitizer. <laughs> yeah. They're consistently low level, but at least they're consistent. Um, how much does Santa's sleigh cost him? Nothing. It was on the house. Uh, yeah, uh, where did Captain Hook get his hook arm? Second hand store. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, we got a lot of stalling time to do here. <laughs> Why don't you ever see elephants hiding in trees? Because they're so darn good at it. Think about it. Yeah. Camouflage. Never mind. Alright. So you see Trader Sampta there? You can see him, right? Yeah. Alright, Trader Sampta is our head salesman. Due to shrinking inventory, Trader Sampta has got a special going on right now. He's offering to trade you any two of your heads. Any two of his hats for just one of yours. 
No matter how you slice it or dice it, folks, you come out ahead. Trader Sam is actually a really nice guy. He invited me over for dinner last week, and I went. About halfway through the meal, I turned to Trader Sam and I said, Sam, I've got to tell you, your wife makes a lovely stew. He said, yes, yes, she does, but I'm sure going to miss her. Yeah, sorry, those cannibal jokes are kind of hard to swallow, aren't they? <laughs> I'm with you on that. He invited me over to their Christmas party last year. There wasn't physical distancing at that point, so we all got to go. Anyway, I showed up late. All the finger foods were gone. All I got was a cold shoulder. <laughs> all right. We got a little bit of stalling to do yet. So you guys notice up here we've got a dock on the left. You guys see that, right? Dock on the left, and we have a dock on the right. It's kind of weird, isn't it? We call that a paradox. <laughs> we got two skippers up there on the dock that are unloading the boat. We call them a paradox. <laughs> we say very nice. We like them a lot. They're very nice people. All right. Well, we got another moment. I'd like to point out some of my favorite flora and fauna. Over here, and this kind of nice over here too. <laughs> that stuff up there, that's called hibiscus. Stuff down there, that's lobiscus. <laughs> the stuff floating in the water back there, we call that sea biscus. Yeah. The stuff with bark on it, we call that doggy biscus. <laughs> doggy bark. Come on, you guys. All right, that was a stretch. I'll give you that one. All right, a couple housekeeping things. As we return to the dock, please remain seated until we come to full police stop. Everyone on this side will call that the uh, jungle side. We'll get up and go out the back door. Everybody on this side will call that the dock side. We'll get up and go out this side door. Do not cross over the crates. It's not a great idea. It's a tripping hazard. We've had people take bad falls over those crates. So we want to keep you safe. You're only allowed to have one bad trip on a jungle cruise trip, and you've already had it, so don't go for two. <laughs> you guys have been outstanding crew now, and you can be outstanding on the dock. Have a good day, guys. Thank you for the pity applause. I appreciate it. I don't know if it needs more pity than I do, so thank you. Have a good Christmas four days ago, guys. Enjoy your Christmas. Thank you for watching. More videos are coming. Please subscribe and ring that notification bell. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what you think. Plus, here's some videos just recently and a video just for you. See you later.